Hello, boils and ghouls. It's your friend Taryn Tats, and I'm here with another video. Um, yes, I do intend to keep on with the Halloween uh, 4K Blu-ray reviews, but I had to kind of do a stop the presses kind of a thing because I could not believe I was actually able to get this today. And I think you already know by the title of the video, what I'm talking about today is I'm reviewing the 4K Blu-ray of Arrow... The Arrow Edition 4K Blu-ray of Dario Argento's Deep Red, a.k.a. Profondo Rosso. And I cannot believe I got this, folks. I mean, I was, <clears throat> I went to my local record store and I was just looking around and um, I found this and I had store credit, so I snagged it up. And uh, yeah, and the reason why I'm so excited about this, because today is October 19th. This movie, it, according to Amazon, this movie's not scheduled to be released until October 26th, so I got it a week early. And honestly, I am just blown away by this presentation of it. Um, <clears throat> I think, uh, here's the thing, you know, I think if, um, you know, people bought, I believe Arrow did, I'm sorry, I know I'm kind of all over the place, I promise, I'll try to make sense in a minute. But um, I believe Arrow did a very similar edition of this when they put it out on blu-ray and you're pretty much getting the same thing but it's 4k and uh which i know that might probably annoy some fans because you know i'm sure they might want to um you know if they want to pick this up but they want to keep their blu-ray you know they probably would have wished maybe like arrow could have done something different maybe you know keep like the cover and stuff but maybe like something a little like a little different artwork or something because I believe that um, um, I believe that uh, Arrow pretty much just kind of reuses the same casing and things like that. They just you know put the different, as you can see there, it's just got the different uh, you know paper on here instead of saying you know Blu-ray, it just says 4K. But um, but yeah, I believe that pretty much everything else is you know very similar to Arrow's Blu-ray release. And so yeah, I would imagine probably some fans would be annoyed with that. You know, because they would probably want something a little bit different so that maybe they could, you know, have it like next to their Blu-ray, you know, so they, you know, you could see the difference between the Blu-ray and the 4K. But anywho, um, I'm really happy about this because Deep Red, I do have, but I have in this edition here from Blue Underground. And this here is definitely an upgrade for me. And uh, this here, the Blu-ray, only has interviews, trailers, and music video. So, I think here, you know, we get just, you know, you know, just an embarrassment of riches, you know, which I know probably people who have bought this edition in Blu-ray are probably just like, it's the same thing. The only thing that's different is 4K. But even still. So, what we have here, we have a new, rest, new 4K restoration of both the original 127-minute Italian version and the 105 minute export version from the original negative by Arrow Films, uh, 4K 2160p. Uh, let's see, presentations of both versions in Dolby Vision HDR10 compatible. Limited edition packaging with reversible sleeve featuring original and newly commissioned artwork by uh, Obviously Creative. Uh, illustrated collector's booklet featuring writing on the film by Alan Jones and Michael. Michael J. Coven and a new essay by Rachel Nisbet. Fold-out double-sided poster featuring original and newly commissioned artwork by Obviously Creative. Six double-sided postcard size uh, lobby card reproduction artwork. Um, art cards, sorry. And uh, disc one, a 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray. Uh, let's see, Deep Red original version. Restored original lossless mono Italian and English soundtracks. Optional lossless 5.1 Italian soundtrack, English subtitles for the Italian soundtrack, optional English subtitles for the deaf and hard of hearing for the English soundtrack, new audio commentary by critics Troy Howarth and Nathaniel Thompson. That's the thing, I didn't buy the, obviously, you see, I got a different uh, Blu-ray of this, so I didn't buy the Arrow Blu-ray, so I'm not really 100% sure, like, you know, if this was on the... Um, like this new audio commentary by Troy Howarth and Nathaniel Thompson. I'm not sure if that was on the uh, the Arrow Blu-ray. Archival audio commentary by Argento expert uh, Thomas Rostock. Rostock. 
Uh, almost three hours of new interviews with members of the cast and crew, including co-writer, director Dario Argento, actors Mika, Mike, Mecca, Morel, uh, G sorry, I know I'm butchering these names, please forgive me. Um, let's see. Gabrielle Lavia, Jacopo Mariani, and Lino Capaliccio, Capaliccio, I believe that's how you say, Argento's original choice for the role of Marcus Daly. Production manager uh, Angelo I Icono, composer Claudio Simonetti, and archival footage of actress Dario Nicolotti, Italian trailer, Arrow Video 2018 trailer, image galleries. Then on disc two, we got the 4K Ultra HD Blu ray of the X4 version, restored original lossless mono English soundtrack, optional English subtitles for the deaf and hard of hearing. Archival introduction to the film by Claudio Simonetti of Goblin, Profondo Giallo, an archival vi visual essay by Michael McKenzie featuring an in-depth appreciation of Deep Red, its themes, and its legacy. Archival interviews with Dario Argento, Dario Nicolotti, uh, Claudio Simonetti, and longtime Argento collaborator Lu Luigi Cosi in U.S. theatrical trailer. So you definitely get a lot more. This is, you know, for me, this is definitely an upgrade from this version. So I'm really happy to get this. And um, I did check it out. Oh, my God. You know, the 4K looks absolutely astonishing. Um, you know, it's, that's the only thing, though. Like, I really couldn't, you know, I hope you'll forgive me, folks. I wasn't actually able to do a comparison because, like I said, the, you know, I didn't have the Arrow Blu-ray release. You know, all I had was this. But when I compared it, when I compare this to this, yeah, the, the picture quality is definitely an improvement. The sound quality is fantastic. You know, and this is, um, this is definitely a movie that really benefits from a 4K release. One of the reasons why I was so glad to get my hands on it is this is one of Argento's most visually stunning films. And um, just his use of color and his, the way he framed his shots and everything else. I mean, it just looked amazing. So it's like, yeah, this is definitely worth the upgrade, especially if you're if you're a diehard Argento fan and you're you know a 4K enthusiast, you're definitely going to want to have this. And like I, I'm pretty sure, like you know, you get the good, you know, you know, you get the good hard case, so nicely protected and everything, you know, beautiful, beautiful edition. And um, yeah. And like I said, I'm pretty sure that there are probably people out there who are upset because it's basically it's the exact same, it's the exact same thing as the limited Blu-ray edition. It's just 4K this time instead of, um, it's 4K instead of Blu-ray this time. Now let's take a quick look at the poster, which I definitely can't wait to get framed and put on my wall. As I say, it's double-sided. So here's one side. I believe this is like the more original cover art or poster art. Kind of looks kind of reminiscent of like um, Vertigo, don't you think? Then we have on the other side we have this here. All right. So I probably I'll probably frame this and you know this is more the original like what that's supposed to look like. So yeah. But anyway, we have the poster which I'm happy about. Definitely, like I said, I can't wait to get a frame for that and put that up. We have the collectible booklet here. You know, really beautiful. Nothing on the back, but, uh, you know, so, you know, like stuff on the inside and, you know, really a great Giallo murder mystery masterpiece. And finally, we get to this here. I switched the, um, you know, I switched to the reversible cover art. I just thought it'd be nice to have that, you know, that white would be a nice contrast to the black of the case. So that's just me. But, yeah, just, uh, oh, man. I can't believe this. I'm so happy to really get this. Now, you have the booklet here. You know, you have disc one, which is the uh, original version. And you got disc two, which is the export version. So, yeah, and they both look amazing. Arrow Video did a great job with their 4K restoration. Even if it is the exact same thing that the Blu-ray was, it's like this is just, oh, wow. I mean, I just, I can't believe how good this looks. And... We go ahead and let's see here. We got our, okay, there's this here. The Snake Girl and the Silver-Haired Witch. Okay. The party doesn't end when your disc does. Discover a new world of the wild and weird. Hours of extras and brand new exclusive only on Arrow. Okay. So we got that. 
And we have our collectible cards here. Each one on the back has deep red on there. So, but anywho, we got this one here. Like I said, I'm sure if you if you bought the limited edition Blu-ray, it's pretty much probably the exact same thing. But since this is new for me, I'm really happy about it. We got this here. What is that? Oh, okay. Okay, there's that part there. Cool. We have this here. this here whoa look at that creepy oh no we have this here it's just fun to say you know i mean deep red is a cool title but you know i don't know profundo rosso it's just so fun to say anyway and then last we got this one here and there we go and I would definitely recommend picking this up, especially if you're an Argento fan, especially if you're a 4K fan, you're definitely going to want to get this. But, you know, like I said, I know people who probably, you know, I've said this probably a dozen times already, but I'm sure people who bought the, the Blu-ray release are probably going to be disappointed because it's the exact same thing. The only difference is it's a 4K disc instead of this. But, I mean, think about it, you know, <clears throat> I appreciate this a lot more that at least they're doing something like this rather than, just you know they put it out and like this is all you get you know it's nice that uh you know that they're doing the same thing with their their 4k releases that they did with their blu-ray releases and putting them in the collectible cases and things like that so you know and uh to me this is this is awesome it's nice to finally you know like i said this you know this little blu-ray uh three pack is what i've had for years and it's just really nice to upgrade to something really snazzy and it's going to look really good on a shelf. And I know I didn't go for the Blu-ray when I had the chance, but I made up for it. Now I got it on 4K, and it looks just absolutely astonishing in 4K, and I can't recommend it enough. There's the back. So, yeah. But go ahead and pick this up, man. If you're an Argento fan and, you know, you love this movie, then, you know, and you're 4K, you know, you're going to want this because the picture quality is absolutely astonishing in 4K. The sound is great. This really is a wonderful upgrade, and I can't recommend it enough. So uh, that's going to pretty much do it. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I just wanted to hurry up and get this quick video out. And um, thank you again. And uh, if you hopefully if you like the video, please leave a like. If you haven't already, go subscribe to the channel. Plenty more to come. And, um, yep, yeah, so everybody take care. Have a good night, boils and ghouls. I'll see you later.